This is Ginza. It's one of the most expensive places in Tokyo. I've been living here for more than half a year and you're like, I know more than you. No, Which no. Which you probably do. Which I probably... don't think so. I think okay, let's check your facts. Um, yeah. What is it? What is yeah. Ginza stand for? Ginza? Yeah. No idea. No idea. What color now? It's a uh, <laughs> gold street. Is that what this means? Is this quite a posh area? Okay, not exactly. It translates to silver mint and the Tokugawa shogunate in the 17th century made Ginza the mint producing area. And eventually it came to be known by the name of the mint. But can you still enjoy your time here? Even if, if you're a broke boy, just say so. So to prove it wrong or correct, we have 1000 yen per bar budget and we're gonna visit three bars. And I'm joined by Milk Saya. Hello, that's, you might... that's me, yeah, that's what they call me over it. <laughs> might know you from uh, videos as the, the sock love making video. Was it the, <laughs> the what? The sock love. Okay, you, you had socks on your hands. Oh yeah, that was good, that was a great. That was good. Creative uh, masterpiece, that one actually, yeah. Underrated, uh, that one. I don't know if still up. Ranking every milk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were doing those shorts. Yeah, yeah, they're still going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah, you're you gonna know. try milks here. Yeah, I might try some. Yeah, do you know the word for it? Cunyu? Milk? I didn't. Cunyu? You didn't know Cunyu? Oh, that's the first word I learned. And thankfully, I don't have to do the research myself, as Time Out has already done it for me. They've listed four different places where you can drink on a budget. So we got this, which was the, um, I, I forgot the name, but it was the house cocktail for 1800 yen. And this is another, which is. Uh, I don't know, it had like rotten wine in it or something. Uh, it's like a fishbowl, but the bottom water is for cooling the cocktail. So the use of it is to chill the main drink and you're not supposed to drink, you're not supposed, hmm. God damn it. Yeah, it's just, it? it's just water. <laughs> <laughs> the entrance fee is also uh, 1000 yen, but we got free water and daily pumpkin puree soup for it. So uh, it was worth it, honestly. Except that all of our budget is now gone, but the view was good at least. Thoughts yeah, yeah. on the um, Ginza bar? Ginza the first bar. uh, Boris. Uh, great rating there, lovely and comfortable, great place to take your potential, you know, romance interests, as we did today. Um, <laughs> yeah, great place, good cocktails, reasonable price for anyone for not in Japan. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> for Ginza, for the city of gold. Yeah, really good. And I'm glad this is a tax trial. It's called 300? 300. Because everything's 300. Oh, really? That's genius. All drinks, all food, everything, 300. Food oh, as well? No cover charge. Oh, so you don't even have to pay to get in? Yes. Oh, wow. Let's check it out. Wow, so good. Oh, good cheese. So the name, absolutely correct this time around. I got a Kalua milk cocktail, he got a lemon sour, and they were 300 yen each. Do you feel anything oh. other than milk? No, but that's a good thing, right? <laughs> that means it's... If that's getting you drunk, that's amazing. It's no? not. Oh, okay. Because right. it's so weak. So you think they've just sold us on soda and milk? This, this is happened here. This is literally like uh, the stuff you get, get at a konbini. Just like uh, a latte. Very milk heavy latte. Right. I feel like you're such a hater, you know? <laughs> also, this place operates on a ticket system. So while, yes, everything was 300 yen, you had to get three tickets minimum. So you had to pay at least 900 yen. And just like pound stores in the UK, while everything is a pound there, technically there's still stuff that is more than a pound. And in this case, uh, better cocktails like the mojito cost two tickets. Are you editing fresh taste? I was like, what the fuck? Oh. Overall, it was still a nice place, just a bit too loud for my taste. Oh yeah, previous. What have you done? What, what, what? Put what's... it back, put it back. What do I... Oh, that's me. That's me before uh, I put this on YouTube and then I got flack for it. Right, what's happened? All right, so put this back. Yeah? Yeah, yeah pull oh. it. I ripped this. Yes. Oh my, how <laughs> have you done this? Yeah. Oh. So now wow. you don't have to like hold it weirdly because it's like over. Oh, up. I see. It's like a little handle exactly. for your chicken. <laughs> that's all of everything. This is the picture of a liver. This place is crazy. That's yeah. a limit, okay. All right, previous well, we bar. Previous bar. Uh, it was under 1,000 yen. It was, it was reasonably cheap, considering- I, I don't like the fact that we had to get tickets. You don't like that? I quite like that system. Well, no, because you can't have like one drink. You need to get like two drinks minimum. Then. Yeah, but okay, I see, because the it's culture like, here is to have one drink and move on. They're what? trapping you within the yeah, bar. In, it's like micro tra micro transactions. Right, <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Uh, <laughs> But overall, drinks were okay though. Yeah, drinks were okay. I don't know how strong they were. I don't know if they were yeah. quite very strong, but drinks were okay. Staff were nice. Everything was good. It was pleasant in there, you know? All I right. thought it was quite good. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. <laughs> that, that's the rating, either thumbs up or thumbs down. And then the plan was to go to the third par. 
Pilsen Alley, but it closed at 10 p.m. So we didn't go there. We just wandered aimlessly on the streets of Ginza, seeing what we could do for barely no money at all, since we were already burned through most of our budgets. Until we reached a sports bar and played some uh, darts. Yeah, that's it. Bye.